All right, so our third example for the change of variable strategy, we got the limit as x goes to zero of x plus 27 to the power of one over three minus three all over x. Uh, what's the first thing we check with limits? Can we make a direct substitution? If we sub in zero for x, we get a denominator of zero, so that won't work. Now, uh, this one is a little different than the other ones because uh, if you recall in the other two examples, we had the ugly exponents like this one, this one over three, to the power of just a single x term, right? But now we have this whole bracket, x plus 27 to the power of one over three. So it's a little bit different, but, uh, but the same, same kind of format applies that we did in the other, uh, in the other two examples. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a general substitution And whenever you get a question like this, you always let the new variable u equal to this whole expression, this whole x plus 27 to the power of one over three. All right, so that's, that's the general substitution uh, that you make. Now, we need to we need to make a, uh, a substitution for this as x goes to zero for this x by itself and this whole expression x plus 27 to the power of one over three which we already did. So now let's do this uh, as x approaches zero, let's find an equivalent expression for that. So we take our general substitution and we sub in zero for x. So we'll have zero plus 27 to the power of one over three, we'll have 27 to the power of one over three. So u is equal to three. All right, so now we have to make a, uh, a substitution for this x here. So what we do is we write out our general substitution again, this x plus 27 to the power of one over three. And now what we're gonna do is to get rid of this one third, we're gonna take both sides to the power of three, right? Because one third times three is just one. So we'll end up with x plus 27, and then we'll have u to the power of three on this side, because what? since we took this side to the power of three, we gotta take this side to the power of three as well bring the 27 over and now we have a substitution for x. So we have a substitution for as x goes to zero, that's equivalent to as u goes to three here. We have a, a substitution for x plus 27 to the power of one over three, that's just equal to u. And then we have a substitution for x uh, after we did this algebra, we got u cubed minus 27. So let's, uh, let's sub these in here and, um, and get our new limit. So the limit, as x goes to zero, that's equivalent uh, to u going to three. x plus 27 to the power of one over three is just u minus this three. And then this x is equal to u cubed minus 27. So we took this limit in terms of x's and now we have a new limit in terms of u's and it's a lot smoother. There's no ugly exponents around. So let's, uh, let's just solve this like a normal limit. So now we factor the, uh, the bottom. That's going to be a, uh, a difference of cubes and we use the difference of cubes formula, so it'll be u squared plus three u plus nine. Let's continue this here. Now this u minus three and this u minus three cancels out, so we'll have one over u squared plus three u plus nine. And now notice how we could sub in three for u and the denominator won't be zero, so we'll have one over three squared is nine, three times three is nine, plus this nine at the end. So our final answer ends up being one over 
27. So let's do a quick recap of what happened. So we, uh, we got this limit and um, we had this x plus 27 to the power of one over three, which was a little different than the other examples. Usually we had uh, the weird exponent just uh, to the power of a single x. When you run into something like this, you let u equal to that whole expression. Then we found, um, then we found equivalent expressions in terms of u for these x values, this as x goes to zero, and for this single x here, using some algebra, subbed in those new expressions for the x values, got this new limit, did a difference of cubes on the bottom, u minus three is canceled out, then you're able to plug in three for u, and you end up with one over 27.